Hey friends, Melinda here. Welcome to my YouTube channel where I post weekly workouts so that you can stay strong, fit, and fierce with me each and every week. If you're new here, make sure that you consider subscribing. Today's block party workout is a two-part series. Part one will be all standing exercises, and then next week, part two will be all floor exercises utilizing a yoga block. What's great about yoga blocks is that they're super cheap. They're a wonderful tool for helping us to get into proper form and alignment, and they add variety and intensity into our sculpting exercises. If you don't have yoga blocks today, that is absolutely fine. Go ahead and modify without them or you can substitute in light hand weights. If you love today's workout, I want you to click that like button below and show me some love. Now let's get ready for part one of our yoga block series. So I'm going to be using two yoga blocks for our series today. Toe tips are in parallel. We're going to take a double plie and then just reach overhead. So double plie, parallel squat and reaching overhead. Pull the rib cage in, reach overhead, double plie, and then reach. If you want to, you can take a releve to the top. So warming up through the ankles here, down, and lift, pulse it down, or you can always stay with the more modified version and just eliminating that releve to start off with today. Again, we're really closing the ribs as we reach overhead. No flaring down, maybe adding that releve. Once you're feeling a little bit more warm, press. Let's take one last one down, exhale, lift. Now plie. Stretch and kick down. So I want you to give me a little squeeze on that yoga block. So that we're working through those shoulders today. Down. So again, we're adding some variety into our sculpting exercises today by utilizing these yoga blocks. Reach and squeeze. Press it out. Down and stretch. I want you to reach your toe tip out, get nice into that deep squat, and then elongating the leg out in front of you. Drop the shoulder down. Again, squeeze into that yoga block. Squeeze, push it forward. Down. Balance and core steady here. Take it down. Exhale, press. One last one. We go into our lateral lunge twist. So lateral lunge, and then we twist. Lateral lunge, and twist. If you want, you could even make it more challenging by keeping the leg lifted the entire time. It causes you to really stabilize core. Up. So you'll notice balance is going to be affected. It's really tight core. Really focus here. Up and lift. Let's go one more. Here we go. Press. Lift it up and twist. Let's take it to the opposite side. Side lateral lunge. Twist it out. Again, you can stay more modified by just tapping that toe in between. Or you're going to start to go where you're lifting it the entire time. I missed it on that one. Down, lift, take it slow and steady. Lift and press. Inhale. Exhale. Breathe. So really trying to find that strong breath. Reach and press one last one from there. So from here, we're gonna take an external rotated position, reach the block overhead, take a lateral flexion, and then pull into a tendu. Lateral flexion. So now we're working through the side bodies and push. So we're sculpting through the obliques, through the back here, trying to find that tall position. So I want you to come up, and long on that standing leg, down, push it away. Drop the shoulders down. Again, I want you to knit your rib cage together. So careful that you're not 
flaring your ribs outward. Down and press. Get low, let's twist it out. So ring out that waistline. Keep it moving here. Twist, whittling through that waistline in four, three, two. Last one, we've got the opposite side lateral flexion, tendu press. Press the heel forward, inner thigh shines forward, down, and then lift. Glide your shoulders down the back, reach. And if you feel that your ribs start to pop open, then just take your yoga block a little bit more in front of the body. That will help you focus a little bit more on wrapping rib, rib cage inward. Down, push it away. Take it all the way down. Lift it strong through your standing leg. Down, exhale. Give me one last one. Down, exhale. Let's twist it out. Rinsing out that waistline. Bring it out here. And now from here, moving right along, we go into a sumo squat. So I'm gonna go vertical with this sumo squat and the yoga block. Down, squeeze. So now I want you to think of a shoulder press, also a chest press. So push in to that yoga block. Reach and squeeze inner thighs and glutes to the top. So we're focusing on a lot of things right now. Shoulders, reach, dropping down the back, push in to that block, down, squeeze and lift. Take it down, exhale, contract at the top, pull down, squeeze and press. So you should feel a little shake here through the shoulder joints. Down, exhale, press. Take it one more. Down, exhale, squeeze it to the top. Moving to our chair. So I'm going to take this long ways into the inner thighs. Toe tips go forward, grabbing the sides of your yoga block, finding your chair sit, and then squeeze back in. Chair, sit down, squeeze. So the yoga block, like I said, is excellent for getting us into proper form and alignment here. So the yoga block in between those inner thighs, it's helping us to engage adductors, but it's helping us to also get those knees into alignment with toe tips. Bring your elbows back, feel this contraction of elbows pulling back. Take it down. Squeeze and press. Inhale. Exhale, squeeze. Lower down. Exhale, last one. From here, I'm going to place that yoga block down. And I'm actually going to go into a lunge from here. So I'm going to set the foot onto your yoga block. From here, I'm actually going to go long ways with this yoga block. We press down and squeeze. Again, getting more of that shoulder work here. Lower down, exhale, down. Working through those thighs here. Down and squeeze, press. Lower it down, starting to feel those thighs really fire up and activate. And press, take it down. Exhale, lift, lower, and lift. Right here, once you push in, pulse, squeeze. Press into that yoga block, press, pulse it out. Inhale, exhale, last one. Woo, thigh is on fire. Let's take it to the other leg from here. So we step that foot onto your yoga block. All right, guys, so now we've got the opposite side. We lunge it down. We exhale and lift. Again, we're pushing into that yoga block with those palms pressing firmly in. Drop those shoulders down. Exhale, squeeze. Take it down. Squeeze and lift. 
press again. Thighs should be on fire here. Take it down. Pull and press. Shoulders working, chest working, legs working hard here. Down. Squeeze and contract. Press down. Lift it up. Engage. And press. Hold it down there. Pulse and squeeze. One inch range of motion here, finding that minimal range of motion of pulsing in that fatigue range of motion. Down, press, one, last one. Bring it to center. Take a breath, inhale, exhale out. Again, inhale, excellent work, guys. Awesome.